But my play today is a celebrity spin to it too, just like Ted Lasso. Let's check out this new video from an, also a noted soccer fan, Ryan Reynolds. Yeah, just super excited. <laughs> yeah. When do we hug? I think we better do I it. I think we better okay. do it right now. <laughs> oh, God. There you have it. T-Mobile announcing it will purchase Ryan Reynolds back Mint Mobile, a direct-to-consumer pre prepaid wireless brand. The price tag on the deal could go as high as $1.35 billion, according to a release from T-Mobile. This means Reynolds, who is a minority owner, will stand to make uh, a nice payday, you could say, and shares of T-Mobile up marginally on the news, but this has me thinking of some other celebrity victories in the M&A space. You see it in the alcohol specter with, with Diageo acquiring another company, Reynolds, have been involved in with Aviation Gin, also with Diageo's purchase of George Clooney's Casamigos. You see it in the makeup space with companies like Coty investing in Kylie Jenner's cosmetics. Rihanna also having success in the makeup space as well and giving a flash of that at the Super Bowl. And that's, I think, really just, it's been interesting to watch how ads like that with Ryan Reynolds, that little bit of touch in the influencer space can kind of carry companies. It's all about the influencers. I mean, these brands all tie themselves up with influencers mm -hmm. and their initiatives, their companies. Yeah, yeah and, and, and this could be a huge win here for T-Mobile because we know organic sales growth, at least within that industry, has been uh, slowing now for quite some time. Mint Mobile has been very, very successful. It gives T-Mobile a boost here within the prepaid space, but also gives them access to the success that Mint has really had in their DTC marketing strategy. Clearly something that T-Mobile could potentially benefit from here going forward.